And blackouts kill people. 11 people died in the Iberian blackout. And that was Goldilocks weather. It wasn't too hot. It wasn't too cold. Right. If you had a blackout in the winter in the UK, it would be more than 11 people dying. Right. So it's not a neutral decision. If you close nuclear power stations early and then you don't have enough capacity to meet demand and you have a blackout and people die. Right. So maybe you should have not had the 100 percent requirements because actually it would have been perfectly safe at 80 and then it wouldn't have had to close. You haven't actually meaningfully compromised safety. Nobody's going to die as a result of that decision. But if you don't change that, people could die because you don't have enough generating capacity available. The 11 people who died in Iberia, one was a house fire because they were using candles. The rest were to do with people using breathing ventilator machines mm. at home. Um, and they had backup generators for that. And so all but three of the people died because the backup generator just didn't work. The other three people died because the backup generator worked, but it was... Uh, malfunctioning and it gave off carbon monoxide 